Hey guys, Wells Knight here, bringing you a brand new Let's Play. This is TerraTech, a indie game on Steam. It runs about 20 bucks on Steam. I haven't played it enough yet to justify, uh, to know if that is a justified price tag or not. But, long story short, we work for a corporation. We have crashed on a planet. And there's all sorts of really cool aspects to this game as far as uh, some action, some building, some combat, all sorts of... Uh, upgradable things and all sorts of fun stuff. So, we're going to work on this a little bit. This is our starter vehicle. It's nothing amazingly fancy, but that will change as we get farther and farther into the game. There are some pretty significant upgrades that we can get. Uh, you can see it's got on screen prompts here going on, hold spacebar, uh, all sorts of fun stuff like that as far as telling us how to play the game, how to uh, improve our stuff, and all that kind of good stuff. So, let's see if we can take this guy down. I'd like to blow up just the cab. There we go, because I want that for myself. Okay. And you can see, as we destroy other vehicles and enemies, we can upgrade our own vehicle. So now we have room for... Two guns, which is pretty spiffy. Um, I think the laser might be better. Yeah, laser might be the way to go. Oh, hello, guy. Where'd you come from? Got rid of his drill. He's got a drill tail. I think I can take him. Come here, you. I want your stuff. There we go. I'll take that. Uh, that's going to explode, but that's not a big deal. And he dropped another gun. We're just loading up on guns right now. We're going to be covered in them. What's this? A storm lantern. Hmm. I don't think I need another drill. Let's take the storm lantern. It sounds interesting. So, this game. Kind of a... Kind of a... Spur of the moment purchase for me. Uh, one of those games that... Uh, I wasn't really you know, planning on it or anything. It just kind of ended up happening. <laughs> um, I saw my buddy Blitz playing it, and uh, it looked really fun. It looked like it was right up my alley, the kind of game that I would enjoy, because I do love building games, as most of you who are familiar with my channel are aware. But this just seemed kind of a nice, uh, a nice little time killer kind of game. I don't know how much content it has. As I said, I haven't played a whole lot of it yet, and I'm certainly no expert. But, it did seem like fun. So we're going to give it a try. We'll see how it goes. We'll see what we think. Um, and we're going to kind of build up a base, progress through the game, and, and see how far we can get. Build up our amazing little combat vehicle here. I might actually rework this. I just had an idea. And we might try it out and see if it works. We got more wheels over here. I'd like to get my hands on some big, larger wheels. Uh as quickly as possible. All right. Receiver is ready to take resources. Basically, you can gather resources from trees and these rock chunks and all sorts of stuff, and you can trade them in for cash that you can then spend on upgrades. And I am getting shot at. You? You you want to tango? Let's tango. Oh, did I get it? Oh, I got it just in time. Okay. So, we're going to... Oh! Oh no! I'm breaking things! So we're actually gonna do this. Cause that will give us... more space. Right click to rotate the camera. Uh, am I missing a wheel? Nope, I've got four wheels. Good, good, good. We'll put that up there. What else have we got? A radar module. Okay. Sure, I'll take a radar module. Then we've got little wheels, and another laser, okay. The more the merrier when it comes to lasers. And another drill, I think I'll pass on the drill. But yeah, now we got some, now we're packing some firepower. Some of my parts are extremely damaged though, so I think I am going to run back to my base real quick, heal up, see what we can get. The other cool thing is that uh, you can... Mine as you go if you want. If we bring down this tree, you can pick it up, 
just by right clicking on it, drag it with you, set it down over here. There you go. And it'll get sucked up and all that good stuff. So it looks like my stuff is now fully repaired. Let's head on over here. Something of interest is going on over here. I'm not exactly sure what it is, but we're going to go find out. Ooh, another foe. Scanner Sniffer. What is a Scanner Sniffer? I don't know what a Scanner Sniffer is, do you? Because I sure don't. Um, whatever it is, I think it's dead. And a stabilizer wheel. Oh, it's supposed to go in the back. Ah, cool. And another radar module, which I think... Oh, did my radar... I think my radar module may have gotten knocked off. That's rather unfortunate. Oh, and another laser. The more the merrier when it comes to guns. Oh, now we're packing some serious heat. All right, let's take a look over here. This is not a good... This is not a good friend. This is a bad guy. Can we... Can we take him down? He dropped my stuff back there. Um... Yeah, let's... Let's go. Let's go. Oh, he's not dead yet. There. Now he's dead. I'm gonna grab that so it doesn't explode. We'll take that off. That goes there. That can go there. Like so. Like so. We'll load up the stuff that we need to load up. I'm actually going to put that on this side. And you can see, already, we're seven minutes into this game. And we've already got a pretty fair amount of new goodies to play around with. So we're going to take this stuff back to our base. Not only so that we can heal, but also that we can just drop some stuff off. Because I don't need this much stuff. And now this module right here... The tractor pad will actually pick up resources for us, up to three at a time. And then we can just deposit it when we get here. Just like so. Just like that. Pretty cool. Pretty nifty. Alright, so what do we not need? We don't need this. That's a refinery. This is the tractor pad that we probably do need. Uh, let's see. What's this thing? Oh, that's a receiver. We'll put that here. Actually, um, let's see if I remember how to do this. There's a way, I believe, to actually connect these things. Like so. So, it will go into the refinery and then into the thing to be sold. Let's test it out and see if I am correct in that. Um, okay, it seems to be refining. Yeah, cool. All right, so we'll just drop that off, and I'm going to put that one over there so it's a little farther away. Okay, so let's head off in this direction and see if we can find some other stuff. Um, I would like to get some better wheels, uh, give myself a little bit more stabilization, because it is actually quite possible to fall all over yourself and basically end up in a pretty nasty predicament. I played for a little bit before I started recording just to kind of get a feel for the controls and all that kind of good stuff. And uh, I'm ashamed to admit that it did not take me very long at all to bite the bullet. So we're just going to go for kind of the centipede uh, look here, <laughs> I guess. Centipede's always fun. Why not? What's this? A storm lantern. I still haven't figured out what exactly those do. And another storm lantern. And then we got a little wheel. Any more wheels? No? No more wheels? Um. Okay. I'll just, I'll just take my lantern and go. Oh! Oh, there's a wheel trapped. Somewhere in here, maybe? Maybe not. Oh, there it is. No, that's, that's one of those Storm Lantern things. Hmm. I really need to figure out what those things do. My turn radius is now absolutely atrocious. But, look at that firepower. That is just insane. Wow. Alright, so. I think what we're going to do is we're going to go into build mode. I'm just going to mostly take myself apart. We'll go up like this. So that I can easily rotate the camera. I'm just going to take pretty much everything off 
and we're gonna do a little bit of a redesign here. So, let's put you there and you there. We'll put that there. Um, how does one rotate? I would like to figure out how to rotate. Rotation, please. Um... Rot... Z? Nope. Okay. Well, maybe it doesn't let you rotate. I thought it did, but I'm certainly not figuring out. We'll put that there. And... Oh, here we go. We got some big wheels now. Excellent. Okay. I thought I had two of those larger parts. I guess not, but we can just use... We can just do one of those. We'll take off these little wheels. Grab one big one. Grab another big one. And are there any more big wheels? That looks like a big wheel to me. Any more? Oh, there we go. Okay. So you got that going for us. Um, we'll put this back a little ways. I am going to take that with me in case I need it. Uh, definitely want to load up on the guns. And the wheels. Let's see. Now you kind of do want to be a little bit strategic about the way that you place like your guns and stuff. Because if you put them in such a way that they're blocked, then they don't really do you a whole lot of good. So for... Why are you flying all the way over there? No. Okay, so let's see here. We got a... Light machine gun, I'll put that up top. We got our two lasers here. We got a bunch of these little fabricate -y thingies. And that's another laser there. Okay, which I'll put on the side. Anything else of value hiding around here? Other than wheels? I don't really need wheels. That's little wheels. Okay, I think we pretty much got everything. Um, I'm going to take these and dump those little uh, fabricator things on here. The uh, the storm lanterns. I mean, I've got open slots on the vehicle for them, so I might as well make use. But I think that'll do pretty nicely. What kind of firepower we got? Oh, oh baby. Oh baby, look at that. And I can carry a lot of stuff, too. Turn radius isn't too bad. Vehicle seems pretty stable. So, all in all, not too shabby. Let's take this stuff back to base. We did get our fabricator, it says, which is good. Um, I believe that's this thing right here. Yes, it is. Two-slot fabricator. Takes two ingredients. Oh, what did it say? Takes two ingredients and fuse them into a third new outcome. Okay, let's, uh, oh man, that turn radius. Okay, drop you guys off as best we can, get some of that stuff going, and that's the fabricator, so I'm going to put it right there, conveyors, it's asking for conveyors, oh, hello, I'm assuming you're a conveyor. Very nice. Conveyor needs to go on the fabricator, okay. And another conveyor. Stick that one on the fabricator too. And a receiver. Okay. Plumbia ingots. Hmm. So, actually, here's a question. Let's try this. If this is our fabricator, and we put this thingy here, Can we... Yeah, we can connect. So the refinery... Okay. Aha. Uh -huh. So... Oh. There we go. We'll put that one there as well. I wish there was a way to just move the whole thing at once. That would make that this a little bit more agreeable, um, I'm gonna kinda 
do our best to move this stuff around. I think that should be fine. Let's go get some of those ingots. I think it's these yellow base looking things. These kind of crystal, these uh, crystal like structures. I, I'm assuming that these are the ingots that it's referring to. And we can carry a fair amount. Not too bad. Let's take those back to base and see if we can maybe refine them into, hey, hey you, stop attacking my base. You're definitely going to regret it, I promise you that much. See, now you have went and angered me. Because now I'm going to wreck you. Goodbye. Get wrecked. Get very wrecked. Anyway. Let's try and drop those off a little bit. There we go. And he did a little bit of damage. Ooh, but we did get another big wheel out of it. And a radar. Okay, I'll take the radar. We can put that on. Give me the upgraded heads up display. I don't see... I see one big wheel. Oh, there's the other one. Okay. So, can I rotate this in like... Aha! Oh, but I can't connect it sideways. Well, that's rather frustrating. So it's mouse wheel to rotate it. But you can't do that. Okay. Let's take off these little wheels here in the middle. And put the big wheels on. Playing with the big kids. Oh, that didn't, that actually really helps turn radius. Quite a lot, actually. We'll get within the repair radius of this thing, let ourselves heal up a little bit. And then we're going to go take a look over here and see what we can find. Just trying to kind of assemble everything and see what we can do. Oh, a manemone. A manemone. What have we got? Sigh, buddy. Sai Wun Poon, whatever that means. I'll take the stuff. Did you drop anything good, Sai Wun Poon? Hmm, doesn't really seem like it. Uh, we do have another laser. Can never have too many lasers, right? We'll just, uh... Can I attach that to the side? Do I have an open slot there? No, I don't. Whatever, I'll just attach it to the back. You never know when you're gonna need, you know, cover from behind. What's this thing? That's a drill. That doesn't do me any good. And uh, I guess we'll just stick a wheel right here so as to help stabilize ourselves. Now, there was something over here that we were going for. I don't remember. Ooh! Ow! Hey! Stop it! Navigating through the trees. Let's come take a look and see what we can find. Another section of our base? Something cool? I'm leaving a relatively secure zone. Somehow I have a feeling that that's not a good thing. Oh, there's... Oh, they're fighting... Are they fighting each other? That doesn't seem like a healthy habit. Oh, I'm, I'm very trapped right now. And that's going to explode and really hurt. And I can kind of aim some of my cannons by aiming with the mouse. But I'm very, uh, very limited. There we go. Got him. All right. Let's see. So we got a payload terminal. We got a couple of these things. Oh, boy. Oh, boy. Get the wheels on. Get the wheels on. There we go. What am I... Sh what's, what's shooting at me? Oh, there you are. That's a terrible mistake. That's a horrible life choice. I assure you. I'm not the one that you want. Because now I'm turning all of my cannons on you and you will quickly meet your demise. Goodbye. Big wheel. Um, that can go there. Another one of those things. Are there any more big wheels lying around? You'd think there would be. There's like five vehicles here that we just destroyed. Um... I will take another part 
piece thing because sooner or later we're going to want to upgrade. No more big wheels, though. At least not that I can see. That's rather disappointing. I was hoping to find something fairly... L hmm. I can't believe there's not another one around here somewhere. Okay. I guess we'll just take a little wheel for now. Oh, I can't actually even connect a wheel to that one. Okay, whatever. We'll sort it out uh, once I get back to the base, I think. But guys, I think that is going to do it for this episode. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, and leave me a comment. I do appreciate it. And it really helps out my channel. You can also find me on Facebook, Twitter, and Twitch. There are links in the video description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll definitely see you next time.